In this video, we're going to discuss when using a record type is appropriate. There isn't always a clear answer, but we can lay some ground rules. When you boil it down, record type influences pick list values and page layout assignment. But the record type doesn't control either of these entirely on its own. Pick list values are determined by record type and controlling fields. And remember, controlling fields are the ones that allow one field to influence the values that are displayed within another. For instance, when the Subaru make is selected, only Subaru models are then shown. Now, page layout assignment is determined by record type and profile. Record types create some administrative overhead, so use them only when you have a clear reason to. Let's look at a few examples. Take the make model example that we showed on the previous slide. Pick list values vary based on the data within another field, make influences model. When that's the case, you can generally use dependent and controlling pick list fields without the need for a record type. The exception to this is that standard fields cannot be dependent on other fields. For instance, the field make can influence model because model is a custom field. However, that same field could not influence the values for opportunity stage, as stage is a standard field. Now, let's say that you want to vary pick list values based on a profile. For instance, the inside sales and outside sales teams use a different set of lead statuses. That requires a record type both because lead status is a standard field and because the values displayed change based on the user's profile and not data within the record. Now, let's say that the sales and marketing teams want information displayed slightly differently on the opportunity page. Pick list values remain the same for both teams. This can be accomplished by creating two different page layouts and using page layout assignment to direct the profile to the corresponding page layout. Record types in this scenario are not required. However, if the sales team had two very different types of leads, let's say one is a consumer lead and the other is a business lead, and that same team works both of these types of leads and the information captured for each very significantly. Now you're looking at one profile that gets assigned a different page layout depending on the type of sale they're engaging in, and that definitely needs a record type.